Here's how to change the keyboard color on your iPhone. Now, if you're on your iPhone and you're bored with just the default gray background color on your iPhone keyboard, you can always spice it up. I'll show you how to do that. But first, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. Thanks, guys. Now, the first thing we'll do is if you open up just anything here that pops up with the keyboard, you'll be able to see there's not much options you have in terms of customizing that specific keyboard. On an Android phone, you have a bunch of different options, but there's nothing built in to the iOS operating system. To customize basically the keyboard and to control the colors, you need to download a third party app, but there are a bunch of different really good options. Let's open up the app store here and we will just type in keyboard. Nope, not keyboard fonts here just keyboard. Now, once we're in here, there's a bunch of different things, but the one that I personally like and use is the Gboard. So it is created by Google. You can see where it is. There it is. Gboard. So this is created by Google. It has a lot of really cool options and features that are built in from Google. So just download and install this or a different app if you prefer. And then after it's downloaded and installed, you can see it here. What we'll need to do first is make sure it's enabled on your phone. So after you download and install it, let's head into your settings. We'll tap on general. And then from here, we'll tap on keyboard. Now at the very top, you can see three keyboards. I'm gonna tap on it and you should be able to see Gboard here and make sure it is toggled on that it is allowed full access to your keyboard. Now, after you've done that, all you need to do is open up any basically thing that pops up with the keyboard and you'll see a little globe at the bottom left. Tap on that globe and then you can tap and hold where it has that little gear icon next to one, two, three. I'm going to go into the settings here and then now I can choose themes. This will allow me to customize and control the theme, which changes the color. I can basically change the background color to be a different light gradient. If I wanted it kind of pinks or blues, I can choose a dark gradient as well. I can choose various landscapes to have as the background color. I have options basically to upload a custom photo, but let's say I just wanted to use sort of a green gradient on here. Let's see which one I sort of like to match the background color of my phone. Now, let's say this one is the one I wanna use. I can just check it. And then if I go back, you'll be able to see it saved within the Google or Gboard app. But now all I need to do is open up the keyboard. You can see just like that, I've changed the color for all of these. Now keep in mind, different apps will of course have their different themes or colors, ones that will change the background color, ones that will change the color of the actual basically characters as you type or as you basically you know have the uh, keyboard on here. So you can change anything that you want, either the foreground or the background. You have complete control depending on that specific app and the features built into that app. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the like button down below and leave a comment if you just have any questions. Thanks, guys.